Hi. I've had a similar conversation many times over the last few weeks and I thought it might help to share that conversation about how we can help ourselves with anxiety. The symptoms of anxiety and panic attacks are awful, but they're stemming from a biological response that was really helpful for us thousands of years ago when we had to run away from a lion, to stand our ground and fight, or quite literally to play dead, to freeze. The chemicals that flood our system in what is called the sympathetic nervous response are very much less than helpful in 2020. Right now, the world is telling us that there is a lot to be anxious about, whether it's worrying about our loved ones, worrying about getting ill, homeschooling without losing your sanity, or quite simply, where to find toilet roll. We start over-breathing, which causes the pain we feel in our chest that can feel like a heart attack. The blood has moved away from our stomach and from the digestive system to the muscles, so we can feel really tense as we're getting ready to run or fight. And we can get acid reflux as the food stays in our stomach for too long, which leads to even more chest pain and more anxiety as we're worrying that we might literally be having a heart attack. There are many ways that we can reduce anxiety. I'm sure you know lots. And the easiest one, the one that we can do by ourselves, anywhere, at any time, is by simply breathing better. I'd like to show you how you can rebalance your body so that you return to a parasympathetic state, which is a more resourceful state where you can relax, you can rest, you will recover and your immune system will be stronger. We tend to think of breathing as starting with an in-breath, but I'd like to invite you to start with an out-breath by pursing your lips and breathing out as if you're maybe blowing through a straw like this. Then breathe in gently through your nose, keeping your shoulders relaxed and inflating your lungs right down to the bottom where the ribs aren't attached to the breastbone and so they can inflate more. Then breathe out, but taking a little bit more time now. And in and out. And in and out. As you continue to breathe, you might like to think of a word or a phrase in your mind as you breathe and relax. Calm, 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 or I am at peace, I am at peace, I am at peace. Imagine your out breath is blowing all the tension away from your body. Try this for a couple of minutes and you'll feel refreshed and you'll feel calm. If you can practice it every morning and every evening, then you are quite literally retraining your brain to breathe in a much healthier way and a way that will help you cope with everything that's going on at the moment. Our brains and our bodies are amazing. You're amazing. Stay safe.